Roy Winifred Lady Outlaws basketball team continued their undefeated season Saturday, winning the Northern Sea Divisional. And when you look at their success in person, it's hard to miss why they're as successful as they are. We've played together for a while, and <laughs> I guess it's been working pretty well so far. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Madeline and Isabel Hegum are sisters, two years apart for the Lady Outlaws, with Isabel a sophomore and Madeline a senior headed for MSU Billings. They both stand over six feet tall and both have helped make their team the team to be at the state tournament next week. It brings so much because if they get past our guards, you know, our defense on top, then they run into them. And then Madeline, and they're, bo they're both grabbing rebounds like nobody's business. With a district title against Belt and divisional title against Box Elder in the span of two weeks, the sisters and the team are poised to get back to the state title game and win it all after falling short last year, coming in third. Our motto is respect all, fear none. So we're going to come out and we're ready to play and we're going to bring everything we got. And we want the gold. <laughs> we want <laughs> yeah. We want to win. We're here to play. Being close-knit sisters, their bond is unmistakable on the court. We, we get along so well. I mean, we've been playing with each other for I don't know how many years, and we're honestly just such good friends. We all work hard. We all have the same goals. As with all sibling relationships, though, there are rivalries. Well, they go against each other every day in practice, so <laughs> we don't have anyone else to guard them. So, <laughs> yeah, but they, they make each other better, for sure. When not playing basketball, the Hegum duo are still hard at work, not on the court, but on their family ranch. Okay. A, lot of, a lot of ranch work. <laughs> when we're not playing basketball, our dad usually puts us to work, you know, but. Head coach Maury Ellenis and the team head into the state tournament as the one seed where they'll have a chance to once again be state champs. We want to just like go get it, you know. Last year they battled hard. Laney was out with a knee injury, so getting a point guard back is going to help. So we're ready to go compete. We've got the guards play, we've got the bigs, so we're ready. Dylan Foreman, MTN Sports.